Did you know who I am, by the way? Yeah. Who am I? It says it right here. <laughs> Carmela. Carmelia. Carmelia. Carmelia Ray, yes. See, I'm, I'm with the reactive team. Yes, you are. Yeah, so I do PR and media, and I just saw you give an incredible tutorial of reactive suite on this massive monitor. So can you tell me what we're looking at over here? Sure. For so, our audience. You sure. can tell our audience. Sure, exactly. So what we're looking at here is a product, the hardware product is the display is uh, from Media Resources, which I'm with, and it's a 1.25 millimeter pixel pitch, and it has, it's flip chip with a GOB coating, so it makes it very handy for touch, okay? Uh, makes it smooth. You can even clean it with uh, a cleaner and wipe it down so you don't gotta worry about I sanitizing. Saw that. I saw um, that. Yeah, it's really cool. You can't do that with the SMD product that you see in the rest of the show here. And we're here at Infocom 2023, um, and it's been a fun, a fun time. So the reactive suite, I've worked with it, uh, with, with Av, um, and I've worked with him for, I don't know, probably uh, almost two years on, on testing and doing stuff. We have some installations with you guys. Yep. Um, and we love the product. We love the hardware from Banto. We love the software from Vizetto. Um, it's just great. I know. Like, what has been the reaction of people coming here? Because there are not, I think this is the only booth that has a touch screen of this magnitude. I think it's the only one, to be honest. Well, there is one other, one but other? it's your booth. Ah, that's right. <laughs> All right. And hey, we're that's actually a good one. That's a good exactly, yeah, and we're actually booth. yeah, and we're yeah. actually using um, the two with Teams so that we can interact with each other and make yes. a virtual presence. That well, that's I'm a matchmaker as well, so that's the perfect match, I think. I love it, isn't it? Okay, so the reaction from the people that are walking by are they are they impressed with the software, the the magnitude of the screen? Is it all of it? I, I think it's all of it. I, I think they the, the first thing that, that, that people are are seeing is the fact that it's a touch screen at their level and we're letting people touch it. Most of the displays here have do not touch oh signs. Oh my God, that's uh, right. Right, so right. we're letting people touch it. We're letting people experience it. We're showing them how things work. We're showing them the pinch zoom, yep. the rotate, the move. We even came up with a game the other day, myself and Jason, um, we called it curling, right? Okay, we would take me. an image, take me. an image over there and curl it across the screen for me. Okay. Right. He's trying to stop it here without going too far. Oh, you did great! If okay, it goes too far, that? yeah, what yeah, yeah. Just, Just grab press it and hold and, and slide it. it. Nope, you did it. There you go. Oh, Look at that. Okay. And if you go too far, go ahead and, and make lose. a real hard you one, lose. right? Oh, oh well, I'll, 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 I'll do it good, real quick. So okay. if you do it too far, it goes back to where it was. Ah, so it resets. Okay, so it bounces. To yeah, the it comes back. Interface. Anyway, yeah, we were just go. having a good time, you know, and we that figured we'd great. come up with, since it's a Canadian company, both of us, right? Yeah. Then we figured we'd do something Canadian. We'll do curling. Yeah, a lot of times people see this and think it's like a really long learning curve. No. Like you are like a pro. You're an expert doing this stuff. Well, so thank you. It, is it because it's easy to use? Oh, it's very easy to use. Very intuitive. If you if you've worked with your iPhone or your Samsung, it's got pinch to zoom, moving stuff around. It's the same thought process, right? Um, a Vizetto, so you don't need a, a rocket science degree to, to no. operate. No. Matter of fact, a if you a five year old can do this. Yeah. Yes. Matter of fact, if you had a rocket science degree, it might be a negative. Okay. okay. <laughs> Too simple for you. Yeah, yeah. Um, so this is stage. Uh, we also have pitch. Yes. What is it about stage that you like the most? I like stage because I can bring multiple things on the stage at one time. You know, pitch is for one one thing, right? right. One one device. I also like the scribble, okay? okay? Because you can describe what you want to do and then you can capture on the screen what that is and create it and export as can a PDF. Can you quickly show me scribble sure. right now? So All scribble, right, we're see, is, see scribble is, this is scribble. So All you right, can see go we've go done some stuff. Go ahead. We've done some stuff here. I'm gonna make this small and then we can actually come over here. I'm going to um, change my to a pen. I'm gonna make it green okay and I can draw over here I'm gonna draw something really simple we'll draw a smiley face and I am NOT an artist that's about okay. the best we'll give him a turn he's like okay. okay so then we can take this and we can actually export that we have to create a page I'm gonna do a custom page and I can draw a picture so the area you see that I have here creates a page I have another page here I'm gonna close that page 
and we're going to export as a PDF. And all I have to do is select the one that I want. So I'm going to export this wow. as a PDF. So this is exporting this as a PDF. Now that puts that into my actual um, assets at the bottom. I can now go back to my stage, and that asset is here, and I can bring that one up right onto the stage, and there's the image I drew. Now I can actually draw on this. I can give him some hair and some ears, or I can say I don't want that, and I can erase it. Oh. Now, so is this this original image is static then? This original image is static, so you can't okay. you can't erase it because it's a file, right? Gotcha. You can actually draw with a pen, and the system will understand whether I'm drawing with a pen or, or whether I'm doing something with my fingers. Okay? okay. And it'll then let me erase with my palm, with the back of my hand. Wow. All right, let's go back up here. That was amazing, and you did it so effortlessly. Well, you know, you guys are really good trainers. Jason is the bomb, okay? <laughs> yes, yes. Now, actually, I've been working with the app for a long time, and I've got a couple of, you know, I've played with it probably before I came to the show, maybe three or four hours. Um, right. But it doesn't take very long to become what you would classify as an expert. Yeah, you learn. And then really you learn, efficient. you learn the pieces that you like. It's kind of like it's kind of like your iPhone or yes. your Samsung phone or whatever. Yes. You learn the features you like and you put them in groups. You don't really use 80% of it, right? No. So um, you would use 70 or 80% of this, but the other parts you would just say, "Ah, eh, I'm not using it much. It's okay." What industries do you think that people would use this in? Higher education, okay. boardrooms, um, even um, kiosks that might be in a, in a location which might need a, an LCD because it's smaller. Right. Um, but places where you want to interact with folks, um, boardrooms are kind of the key place that I see it right, right. now. Um, boardrooms for stage. Right. Or yeah. education or a TED Talk. Can you imagine doing a TED Talk? Like, oh, my gosh. Oh, my God. That would be amazing. Yeah. I don't even know who TED is. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. They have millions of views. I know, right? Um, all right. And so how do, how do our folks get a hold of your technology to bring this bad boy into their boardroom or into their living room? Can Wherever. Can people watch TV on this Absolutely. And absolutely. Okay, you yeah, can. absolutely. Yeah. Can you imagine that? I mean, you can find us at www.mediaresources.com. And then uh, we're going to be integrating some websites together with uh, uh, Banto and Vizetto as well. But you Amazing. can also find Vizetto at Vizetto.com. Um, right? so. There you go, guys. We are live here at Infocom 2023. Two booths have this technology, and it is Reactive Suite and Media Resources. So come on down and check us out if you happen to be here. Otherwise, just place an order, and you'll have it in your home. There you go. Thanks. All right.